Today we're going to have a quick look at the brand new plasma consumables from Hypertherm, where they claim they can bend the rules of conventional plasma cutting. Conventionally cutting these lugs off this plate would cause lots of damage and lots of rework. If you were to do this with oxyfuel, the angle of attack and the amount of material left on this base plate would be quite big. The heat affected zone would be huge and the amount of rework left after the job would be astronomical. If you were to try and arc air gouge this off, you would still have to come in from both sides, arc air the material off, it's very messy and it's very noisy. If you wanted to cut it with conventional plasma, you would again leave a lot of material on the plate for reworking, regouging and refettling with grinding and abrasives. But the engineers at Hypertherm have come up with a way of bending the rules and by bending the arc with their brand new flush cut consumables we can get as close as 2.5mm to this base plate and cutting this big 25mm lug off here with a big well down both sides off in one pass.
Hypertherm are what I class as a forward thinking company and their products and inventions are all a solution to somebody else's problem and that's what I like about them as a company. The brand new flush cut consumables speak for themselves. They take away hours of what conventionally would have been grinding and fettling and sanding and maybe even repairing of the parent plate. The lifting lugs would have been not usable again, you would damage them, you would have cut into them, uh, they wouldn't have been suitable for the job. We stretched the boundaries, we did this with a 25mm lug onto some 25mm plate and one of those welds on one of those lugs was a three pass weld. Hypertherm say with the Powermax 105 that the cut capability of the brand new flush cut consumables is 40mm. We had about 45mm worth of cut today. Speaking outside the box, I think that's pretty fantastic. If you take away the hours and hours and hours that you would have conventionally with oxy fuel, damaging the parent material, using your cutting torch at an angle and having maybe five or 10 mil worth of material left on that plate to fell off, I think flush cut and the consumable price speaks for itself. My name's Barry, this is MS Welding TV, and thanks for checking out my flush cut consumable tech review. Oh